by the Single Malt Whiskey Club. The Burns tradition is long. Uh, the first recorded Burns Supper was in 1801. So uh, our five years is a very short history compared to the history of Burns Suppers that have gone on around the world. Uh, it's a traditional dinner. Uh, we're going to follow the traditional format. Uh, I will ask you after this short welcome to take your seats. Uh, and then Tom will come and uh, say the talk of grace, which is the uh, traditional way of opening the evening. We'll then serve the first course, which will be cockaliki soup. There's a lot of uh, Scottish delicacies tonight. Uh, after the first course, uh, the haggis will be piped in. I'm happy to announce this is the very first homemade haggis that the, whis the whiskey club has been able to enjoy on a Burns night. Uh, it's been prepared by Victor. Uh, it's perfectly palatable and has excluded several of the ingredients that some of you may not like to eat. So the haggis will be piped in. I will do the address to the haggis. We'll then have family style dinner. Haggis is optional, but I do encourage you to try it. Uh, and then after the first course, we'll go into the other speeches, which will be opened by Gary Christensen, who's going to do an immortalization of the life and work of Robbie Burns, great Scottish poet, who is presented here for your viewing pleasure. Uh, and after Gary, we'll go to the toast to the lassies from Greg Wilson, uh, and there will be a response from... Uh, Laura. Laura. Oh, excuse me, a response from Laura. You know, she played golf with Andy yesterday, there's no excuse for this. Uh, <laughs> uh, a response from Laura uh, to uh, the toast to the, to the lassies. At the end of the evening, we'll, start, we'll close the evening in the traditional style, which is singing Old Lang Syne. We'll provide for you uh, some song sheets so you can sing along. So with that, I'd ask you to take your seats. Once you're seated, uh, Tom will uh, say the self-grace, and then we'll get started with dinner. So thank you all.